Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Natalia and today is a Shein haul. I am so excited. I finally got my first order. It got stuck in shipping limbo. It got stuck for over a month. I ordered these items on April 17th and I got them today, June 1st. So I'm finally Finally, because these were the items I really, really wanted. I did a second order, which came within two weeks. That was the Shein mask that I did a video for right here. And then about a week and a half ago, I did a third order from Shein, even though I hadn't got my first. I was hoping, but I really wanted a couple more items. So I did a third order and those should be here within the week, hopefully. Fingers crossed, because they're past the point that this guy got stuck in. So let's get to it. And here we go. Yay! I am so excited for all of this stuff. There's quite a few great things here, but let's start with... Ah, here it is. The makeup brushes. I really wanted these guys. It's kind of hard to see. I'll take a few out. Um, but they were, I believe, six dollars. Plastic is crinkly. So I got all of these brushes for six dollars. And there's just a whole bunch of duplicates. It makes it easier when I'm doing a whole bunch of different colors. I don't have to do the color switch pad. I can just use a bunch of different brushes and then... I clean them all later. At least then I don't get them muddled. When I do the James Morphe palette on Sunday, you'll see that I kind of muddled the colors a little bit because I was literally using the same brush for five different bright exuberant colors and with these brushes they may not be the best of quality but they feel really nice they're not too bad they do have a couple of hairs that stick out a little bit but we'll see how they work out and i'll definitely in a future video use these and let you guys know what's going on so if you want to see that video go ahead and subscribe hit that bell notification so you will get alerted when i upload so i'm gonna go on and now I'm gonna do whole body with clothes and let's get to it. All right, so this is one of the tops. It has little pearls on it. It fits fine. It's kind of, I mean, it's wrinkly, so it doesn't look fabulous. The arms are a little bit tight, but I am losing weight, so hopefully I'll get rid of the, get rid of the arms a little bit too. But this is nice. I, I'm looking at my mirror <laughs> right here. It's a little, it's a little see-through. It's a little see-through. I would probably wear, I have nude camis that I would probably wear under this. Just feel better, but it's, I'll definitely wear it. It's cute. And like, I, I got a pair of white pants and I think, not in this order, but in my third order, I got some white pants and I think this would look really cute with white. It'd be very spring summery. This was definitely a spring top, but you know, spring got canceled. <laughs> so yeah, this is, this is one top. It's really cute. It has a little button and then it's like ruffles on the sleeves and stuff. Kind of poofy. It's cute. I like it. And you can see right up here, you can see the pearls. It kind of lifts weird, probably because my little ladies are a little big. My, that might be why, but you know. All right, let's go on to the next one. Okay, so this is the other top that I don't really have bottoms for. The other outfits that I have are either full length or, you know, there's a bottom and a top to them. So, this is the other one. It's cute navy with star white stars on it. You can see, I can show you close up, and you can kind of like drop it off the shoulder and just kind of... You know, it's nice, it's it's comfortable, it's kind of a sweater material, kind of not. So it's very lightweight and breathable, definitely good for the season. Again, that nice pair of white pants, and this would be really, really cute any time of the year. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, 
how is this one it is loose going by the measurements i would say go by your measurements and then go down like a size and a half to two sizes because this is kind of big on me god my goodness gracious my tan lines are you know fabulous right now okay but this is the this this bathing suit is really cute and it would hold me a lot better if it was smaller i went by the measurements and i was kind of worried because even like the 3x measurement was still smaller than what my actual measurements were and this yeah i probably could have gone instead of a 3x i could have done a 1x even maybe a 0x it, this is a plus size uh, the first two items were regular sizes it's just in certain things i'm a lot bigger and in other things I'm not and I really wasn't sure and I just went by the measurements which for the bathing suit go down a couple of sizes this bathing suit is really really cute I may go ahead and see if my alteration place can maybe make it a little tighter for me because it's like look at this And it said what? It said uh, hips were 44, waist was 31. Now, my waist is 37 and my hips are 47. So, the hat is cute, but this this little guy comes off really easily. So, I don't know. I may like sew it on or I may just get rid of it. I'm not sure. It's actually, this is actually a gift for my mom. It was supposed to be for her birthday, which was on May 27th. I figured April 17th, this will definitely come by my mom's birthday. No, it came a week after, three days after, four days after. I bought my mom other stuff instead. But she still gets this and it's a really cute hat. It's just like, it'll take time to get these crinkles out from being folded into the packing bag. Overall, I really like this hat. I'm a little confused because there's a strap to hold it on your head. I'm just putting this off to the side right now. But yeah, so there's this strap that you can use either to, I'm not 100% sure what it's for. I'm assuming it's to keep it on your head when it's like super duper windy. All the pictures show on vacay being in the back, yet the strap goes from on vacay to the front. So it would be like, I would wear it here and on vacay would be on the side. It works. I mean, I'm not mad about it. If the wind is blowing so hard that I'm using the strap, I'm not gonna be super upset that it's on the side instead of the back because I just don't want to lose the hat. But overall, the quality is really nice. I, I think it's perfect quality for a bathing suit. It's just big. It's big, but it's cute. Okay, you can see my brow strap, so I'm just gonna kinda let it be right now. I do have those bunny ear booby stickies, uh, whatever you call them, the invisible bunny bra thing. That was also in the video with the Shein mask. It's down in the links below, so you can see that. That's what I plan on using for this. I think it'll work really well. I just don't wanna go through all the methods of uh, putting it on <laughs> right now. I really do like this dress. I'm not a huge fan of the tie here. Overall, I think that this is really kind of cute. I, I really do think this is kind of cute. I'm a little annoyed that the washing instructions for this piece is to get it dry clean. I'm like, I think I paid like $10 for it and it has to be dry clean. I mean, I do dry clean my pillow, my pillowcases, so another 10 bucks to dry clean it. I mean, that's not too bad. The arms are a little tight. I need to, I, I didn't really think of measuring my arms so much for the clothes and I'm definitely going to pay attention to that a little bit more if I plan to buy anything that 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 goes down to this part of the arm or my elbow because it's just a little tight but like I said I am losing weight so even if it's a tiny bit tight maybe it'll loosen up a little bit but this is really cute I really like the colors in this yeah I really like this it's a nice off the shoulder kind of cute moment and the material is really nice obviously it has to be dry clean so it better be all right let's go on to the next one okay so here's this one i don't know i kind of feel like this is definitely um 
see-through. I mean, I do have a full piece that like goes all the way up to here and then, I don't know. I would have to wear those, the bunny ears again and I don't know if it would show too much. Um, like I said, I'm looking at my mirror here and I'm just kind of, I'm not a huge fan. I kind of want to cut these off, the sleeves off, like now. Let's hang on. Can I get them off? I don't know. I kind of like that without the sleeves a little better. The material's okay, but like I said, it is see-through. I can definitely tell the difference between my underwear to my belly to my bra that I have on right now, and I'm just kind of okay. And definitely better without the sleeves. Again, they were really tight on my arms. I need to do arm workouts. Okay, so this, the skirt, was one of the first items that I put on my list. It's cute, it's nice, and it's like corduroy material, which is fine. And then I got this cute sunflower top, and I think it really works well with this outfit. It's super cute. I love this. This, this is worth it. I just wanted super cute nice stuff you can see the top it's just a really cute nice little little skirt okay this is another winner the skirt it's the same as the last one it's just a different color it's a dark like army type green and then this top it it's slightly slightly see-through i've had plenty of tops that are like this a lot of white t-shirts are often slightly see-through but it's honestly i don't notice it i can notice it like a little bit up here but for the rest of the shirt like i don't notice a huge difference between my stomach and my bra that's when i really notice if it's see-through or not and this one doesn't show that so it says good things take time it's just a really cute top that has a nice little saying. This one can interchange with the other top with this skirt. So here's the skirt and then you can see the shoes. I purchased these shoes at the same time that I bought this skirt. So I got these shoes like two weeks after or not, not even two weeks. It was a couple days after. I put it in a video right around here. I just really like these shoes. They are a different green. They're actually closer to the green in the sunflower shirt. They are still really cute and they work well. I bought them for this outfit and I think it works. All right, so I just have one more top to show you. I forgot at the beginning of this when I was doing everything. So I'm gonna pop back into my jeans and show you that very last top. Yeah, this, I think this top's a fail. It's really cute. Maybe if I put like a tank top underneath it, like a, a white cami or maybe a navy blue cami or something, it would work. But right now it's squishing my boobs because it's zipped up. It's too tight right here otherwise it's fine up here and it's fine down here but it's just not giving the girls any space and there's literally like you can tell there's like boob flat crushed boob <laughs> it's tight right there and i would just be to unzip it it would go all the way down to here and i'd just be like out all over the place. I'm not super upset because I mean these clothes were a really good price. Overall like the quality is fine like this you can't see through it so that's nice and then like I said I would put a cami on underneath. Let me try that real fast. Now how's that? I mean it's not bad. I have a pink cami that's like this color as well and then I could do something funky like putting a light blue cami underneath. I mean there's a couple of different options and it's not too bad leaving it open like this so there's definitely some workarounds you just have to play with the clothes a little bit and I it's not bad I paid $90 for all of these that included the makeup brushes the hat a bathing suit three tops a romper well no <sighs> it was a total of 13 items I know that so I mean 
I'm really kind of happy with this haul. There are things that I'm going to adjust a little bit, but it's not that big a deal. I saved a lot of money just purchasing this stuff, so altering it a little bit so it will definitely fit me perfectly. I'm not upset about it. I really enjoy this stuff. I'm probably definitely going to order again. There's going to be another Shein haul later, hopefully, probably next week. Hopefully, if I get the package, it should be. It's past the point this one got stuck in, so hopefully I get it soon. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a like, subscribe, and I hope you all have a wonderful, beautiful, healthy, fabulous day. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye!